Hi guys, it's me, Yubi Programmer, and today we will be discussing about a machine learning project which is Wine Quality Prediction System, right? So let's just run our Flask app and see what we have built, right? So I'm starting Flask app, go to this server, and this is uh, the uh, UI of our app. So it's a simple form which is asking for some parameter obviously uh, which you can get some idea if I can show you the link of the data set right okay so this was the data set on which the whole app is built and you can get some idea about all these columns from this link right i'll be sharing this with you in the uh, description below right and let's just uh, put some values uh, let's do one thing that if i can show you my notebook from where i did the eda and all with the data and yeah so from here we can just copy paste some values because uh, i don't know about all the values of all this stuff uh, but yeah you should do some uh, research about the domain on which you are working with right so if you are working with uh, the data about wine so you should have some idea about all these parameters right but for the sake of this uh, demo video, I will just try to copy paste this and see if the results we are getting is same according to our data, right? Okay, let me just... Copy paste it. okay last parameter let's just put the value and hit the submit so you can see we are getting you have bad quality one right and this was uh, obviously the result you can see here also bad quality one so uh, it's clear right uh, that our application is working well let's see how we have built this model and if i can show you the data set uh, which was this i loaded it into jupyter notebook uh, then some eda on it and then applied uh, random forest classifier model right which will always like give you better accuracy than other regressor model uh, you can always like play, uh, play around with it random forest classifier and we got the accuracy about 93.1 percent and then we have just uh, deployed it into our flask app so these are all the features uh, which we are getting from the user from our app in the index right so this was the form we are getting these features and uh, storing these values in these variables and then giving it into our input uh, to our model right and then uh, whatever the result will be like uh, stored in the result variable and then we are passing this variable into our display template right so this result will be shown as you can see here 
and you can always like uh, if you want this uh, source code or uh, maybe uh, you want a zoom explainer session for this project or any project like that you can always contact me on this whatsapp number or maybe mail me at this gmail and i will respond as soon as possible and uh, that's it for today guys thank you